I'm pretty sure here I'm studying on the basic study analysis on for MAAT assignment. Okay, starting I'll using the PID. Okay, basically PID is to check the malware is it back or not. Okay, now I'll open the malware using the PID, which the malware is located at the mal desktop. Okay. So okay basically the PID will show that the AP session which is the pointer section, which is the text file and this is the compiler, Microsoft CAP SFX which is so that this is a compiler to open this pro, uh, this malware.exe which is not packed normally if packed, it's not, it will not be showing the compiler okay now I'll do the uh, PE view okay, so basically PE view is just to actually view out the file data which you can see from the from P view actually the important things to analyze is that the time date stamp of the malware actually like uh when is the malware compo compose which uh is called time date stamp which is February uh two thousand four uh August four Wednesday 6.01 p.m. or oh, a.m. Yeah. Uh, okay, so basically this is it and basically this one is show the image the image file which is show header and image option header yeah okay that's all for P view so bin text okay so bin text basically is a program that actually show what does the program contain the text the text file inside the computer uh, mal the dot malware dot exe. Okay, from here you can see some process is here like get last load library, close handle and stuff. Get like create directory is basically this malware. But what the what does this malware do? Okay, so basically this in text you can actually find out. You can analyze the malware which using this program to find out what type of what type. Uh, what this model can do before actually run the program to, uh, basically before the dynamic analysis which is to basically find out uh, the program find out the model what it's doing by running it but for this basic study analysis but for, but only, but for bin text actually you can find out some processes which is actually for uh, some, some processes which is which in this program okay that's it for bin text Okay, so basically, uh, I will go on dependency worker. So basically, dependency worker, uh, what does dependency worker do? Dependency worker actually show you the DRL that the that the malware contain. As you can see from, especially you can see like malware.exe, which is the main program itself, and the DRL, ADPI, and kernel thirty two. These are those important API. You can see there is our uh, register create key which to create a registry for the malware itself. Actually malware replace the registry with a current which is the real one to cover up actually to override it. So current thirty two you also can see there's a close handle create file. Create file actually is to create a file in the program in the system itself. And also create file mapping with the location of the file. Okay, yeah, there's a lot of you can see here. Get current process, get current process ID, get current thread. All those are called suspicious API that is used to they are used by this malware. Okay. So for can as, as you can see there's a lot of DRL, so I'll just go through some of them. I go through uh IDP PA PI32, also credit 32 Credit 32 is the system. Win trust is the basically verify the trust of the of the system of the window. Okay, so security two basically is the just getting the username of the user, basically getting user information which is from security two to DRL. Okay, so I think that's all for the basic analysis. Thank you.